and we are live. Hey, this is Jeff Wick, editor of the Fayette County Record, joined as always by a man that needs no introduction, a man of a mysterious political affiliation, uh, Andy Balin. Uh, and we are here at Brawley Dental, beautiful Brawley Dental on the Courthouse Square in LaGrange, a wonderfully renovated historic building here uh, with a thriving dental practice inside. Uh, hot off the presses, we got the first copy of uh, the new edition of the Fayette County Record. Uh, we're going to go inside and uh, talk about some news, talk about some teeth, and uh, get off this street because this is actually a really dangerous time to be out here right now. It's, it's, hot. it's hot for one, but it's Senior Citizen Day uh, as part oh, of the yeah. uh, festivities yeah. of, of the uh, uh, 92nd Annual Fayette County Fair, and just about three blocks away, yep. a bunch of old people. Are drinking a bunch of beer <laughs> and uh, uh, so it's probably going to be safer inside of course the the uh, rest of the fair kicks off this evening uh, Thursday through Sunday um, and we'll be busy covering a lot of that but that's for the next edition of the paper we're talking about this one and uh, so let's go inside and uh, we're gonna actually be careful on what Andy says because uh, he had some laughing gas right? uh, <laughs> yeah. 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 And so check out this entryway um, and we're going to see if we can find the people that put Brawley in Brawley Dental. There's the man himself, Curtis Brawley. Hey, hey, thanks so much for having us. Thanks, Jeff. Thank you. <laughs> so is, is the doc uh, back there? Oh, there she comes right out. Right around the floor. Fresh, fresh off uh, some uh, root canals or something now. <laughs> yeah, no telling. Dr. Hi. Kerry Brawley. <laughs> thank you all so much for having us. You no all problem. are the thank first you. people in Fayette County to get your hands on a... Uh, on the newest edition of the Fayette County Record. Perfect, thank you. And uh, we're standing here in this wonderful entryway of y'all's new building. Um, yes. uh, I, I can only imagine that this turned out even better than y'all thought, right? Even better. Even better. Yes, yeah. we knew we wanted to remodel it, but it turned out better. <laughs> I love that garden outside, too. That's thank awesome. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Let me give a shout out to Nathan Hess for that. Hey, on, most, uh, on the busiest street in town, some, some beautiful landscaping to go with this beautiful building. Um, we'll talk some more about the building and the practice in a few minutes, but I think in exchange for some free dental work on Andy, Andy's going to fill you all in on some of the, uh, the headlines in the new edition of the paper. So why don't we yeah, go ahead and head on back? Seat. Sure, <laughs> sure. Wow. Yeah, I mean, we're walking through beautiful high ceilings, great, uh, you know, uh, patient base here. <laughs> Look at that view too, Andy. While you're getting uh, getting all this work done, you get, to, uh, you get to have a lot of sunlight. And uh, here, Curtis, why don't you hand Andy that newspaper there, and uh, he'll fill you all in on some of the things y'all can find in the new edition of the paper. Sure. Well, at the top of the front page, the big news is that the town of Round Top is running out of water. They're, uh, town of Ellinger. I mean, town of Ellinger, not Round Top. Wait, I'm sorry. I've got <laughs> them all clustered yeah. already. Yeah. Just yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was all that laughing gas. Yeah, it was. It right. was. No, the town of Ellinger. They're they're running out of water. I went to a meeting over there this week, and um, they their old water well. It's about it's it was dug in the 1970s, and uh, it's just playing out. It's 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 on it's on its last leg. The engineers said it should have failed a couple of years ago, and um, they already have a problem with arsenic in their water, and they're having a hard time finding a place to drill a well. They, they spent $200,000 drilling this pilot hole and they can't get enough water out of it to supply the town. So they're in real bad shape over there. And um, if that well goes dry, they're gonna be in a world of hurt. Um, so uh, also uh, on, the, on the front page, uh, the Hope Hill annexation failed by one vote at the city council meeting on Monday. Uh, Jeff was there and covering that story. Very uh, interesting meeting. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Um, other stuff out of uh, the city council meeting here in LaGrange was uh, the tax rate's going to stay the same this year. A uh, new secretary was hired, um, some construction news, and then we have a look back at Hurricane Harvey from two years ago. Uh, some photos from that devastating storm that came through LaGrange that we're still dealing with yeah, today. Yeah, in, in, uh, in a way it seems like a really long time ago, and in a way it seems like it was you know, just a few months ago, and, and still there's uh, a big road to recovery for a lot of folks here. Um, Elaine Thomas has a wonderful story about Marge and Ralph Rosenberg and their their time uh, working with the Fayette County Fair over all these years. Uh, the fair's this weekend, so uh, you can kind of look back at a lot of history about the fair in this article, so take a look at that. Um, in sports news, uh, 
we have a preview of the of the football games that are that are uh, going on this week. Uh, also, uh, volleyball roundup. Uh, Lagrange fell to Brenham. Uh, Fayetteville won their game. Uh, nice little story here about Tri County uh, umpire uh, uh, needing more mem The Tri County umpires group needing more members. So uh, take a look at that if you're interested in, uh, in uh, maybe umpiring some games. Heritage Hallmark is closing here on the square at the end of next month. Kind of sad news. Um, Gail Linky has been at that business since 1982, I found out yesterday when I interviewed her. And uh, she's just a, a greeting card industry, and, the, uh, uh, and those kind of mom and pop stores are having a hard time competing in today's market. And uh, uh, it's just uh, kind of a sign of the times. Uh, Commissioner's Court gave final approval to that two cent tax increase, and you can read about that. Uh, uh, Judge Weber uh, 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 put in a, um, he, he really wanted to have the county put in a contingency fund in this year's budget. And um, uh, that's, been, that's been put in there, $635,000 in reserve funds are now in the budget. Um, also, a 4-H banquet um, was held recently, and we got photos of all the winners from that. Uh, public notices, as always, and lots more in today's paper. This is our TMC issue that goes out to every, uh, every, every mailbox in the county. Hey, I know those two guys on the front of that. Yeah, place. we got a couple of opinion pieces here. Uh, well, uh, uh, Jeff has a wonderful story about his uh, travels to the West Coast, uh, riding in a train recently, and I have a uh, I have a story about uh, about uh, oh, you can you can read it. It's on, it's on, <laughs> it's on, story it's about on, politics. It's on it's on it's on it's on page D one. So check that out. This is a perfect chair for reading the paper, though. It's great natural yeah, it's light. Nice. And so, Doc, before yeah. you start drilling on Andy here, yeah. why don't you tell us about this? You yeah. know, uh, uh, you know all the things y'all are able to offer in this new facility. I mean, some people say, you know, maybe going to the dentist is not fun, but in a great place like this, you know, a, a very peaceful setting, I would almost describe it. Um, it does. You it know, the things y'all are more, able to offer. A lot more peaceful now that and a lot more natural light, which is yeah. awesome, we love. Um, we got a, all new equipment, so ready to go there. We we're also getting some new technology as far as one of our first things we're gonna get is called oral ID and it's a oral cancer detection device. Oh, wow. oh. So one of the newer ones on the market. So we're gonna go with that. So we're in the process of getting trained and everything to do that so that we can offer that. We do oral I, um, oral cancer screenings, but this is gonna help us just mm -hmm. elevate it. Yeah. Um, sure, early detection is a uh, Early key detection is all that key, kind of stuff. especially for oral cancer. Mm -hmm. So and we do those whenever, every time patients come in with their exams, but this is just going to elevate what we can do. So, you know, how long have you been practicing uh, here? I've been in LaGrange since 06. Since 06. Wow. And now when was this new facility completed? You know, you know all the renovations they all had here and expansion. In June. In June. Earlier okay. this year. Okay. So in June. So we are, it was the fun process. <laughs> yeah. Talk about, Glad talk about the done. process of converting, you know, cause, mm -hmm. um, you know, we're, confined to just an area next door, right? And then y'all expanded into yes. this. Uh, it, did it double the space y'all It doubled had? our space, basically. Wow. Uh, somebody asked me what my ultimate goal was, and I said we're gonna bust through walls and it double our space. Mm. And I didn't anticipate it being quite <laughs> so quickly, but we did it. <laughs> so we continued to work out of our old office, mm. if you will. Mm -hmm. Construction happened over here. We had some great construction guys. At one point, we were down for one week where we busted through walls, literally. So in the midst of all that work, mm -hmm. y'all only had to close the office week. for one week. Mm -hmm. wow. Mm -hmm. wow. We coordinated very well, yeah. very structured, busted through walls, got fully open, kind of blocked off the, re the half we were in. We're able to work out of this side while they mm -hmm. completed construction over there. So no, there was some noise for a while. Yeah, I remember that. No, it was, uh, this wall here was completely this closed up. Y'all put these windows we in? We put windows in. We got that all approved. Um, put windows in. We wanted the light. We feel like people feel a little claustrophobic at the dentist mm -hmm. anyway because we're in your personal space. So we think this has been helping people feel a little bit yeah, more yeah, open. for sure. And uh, any surprises, you know, as you renovated a, a really old building? So we did. It was really old. Um, surprises? Not so much. We planned, we demoed this side um, first, 
before we finalize the exact plans mm -hmm. because there are some brick walls in between the two sides. Oh, okay. We wanted to know exactly to the, you have to know exactly to the inch where it is mm -hmm. so you can get equipment around it. So we actually demoed the site so we would know exactly. Then we finalized plans before we started. So I wouldn't say too, not, nothing too, too major. Yeah. No uh, skeletons found in the walls <laughs> or <laughs> old uh, artifacts. No skeletons. Um, lots of pots and pans. Really? Um, really? Um, some pocket knives, some bo lots of bottles. And the oh, dirt. Right. Um, so I don't know. Uh, slab, preceded, yes. I guess, 1939, because that's when we think that brick was done. Oh, yeah. That's when huh. we think the beam was done, 1939. Mm. So all the brick and everything we try to keep, we made it back to original. Wow. They had covered it up and we exposed it. I think the most that's interesting what the noise thing was. was the, uh, if if you look at the thickness here, yeah, those yeah. those walls and the walls on on the other side next to Smith's are thirteen inches thick. Wow, and they're all brick. Wow, lots of brick. There's no filler in there. It's brick. Oh, um, so it, it took these guys a long time to plow holes through <laughs> yeah. the wall. Wow, yeah. and all the noise. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> noise I think it was worth it. Yeah. Oh, for sure. For yeah. sure. We're very excited about it. Now, if somebody's watching this and uh, you know they're not already patients at right. Brawley Dental, what should they do? They can give us a call. Um, the number is 968-5813, or you can look us up on the website, which is BrawleyDental.com. Yeah. Are you all on Facebook? We're on Facebook. We'll, link to, the, we'll link to that uh, Facebook page in this video. Yeah. So. Yeah, we're on Facebook, too. Yep. Facebook and Instagram. So are we at liberty to walk through a little more yeah, area here? Let's check out. I mean, this is just such a great building. And we did expand our, we have more offs now, our office. Yeah, this is a ton. How many uh, How many bays or operatories you call them? We went from six. We have eight running right wow. now. And we'll, when all is said and done, we'll have ten. But eight running right now. Come on through. Our sterilization and then more ops. And these ops actually have some brick in them because, again, we wanted to keep some of the yeah. original. Yeah. And the brick was the midline between what we was our old section versus what was our new it's pretty all right so i got a dental question oh okay how necessary is flossing really very <laughs> very a toothbrush doesn't touch in between your teeth so cavities are most common in between because a toothbrush doesn't touch there so floss is the only thing Oops. that does what Come about turning lights? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what about what about those water picks? Are they any water good? Water picks are great. Are they? Okay. Yes. So if you are not a flosser, yeah, I will take a water pick if you will use okay. one. They're great. Yeah. We had one of those water picks when I was a kid, but we just used it kind of as a water gun. It, we sprayed yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then our our team kitchen, which we doubled the size because we didn't have. Much All right, so as a dentist, what's yes. the one food, snack, candy to stay away from? Oh. Anything that the big no-no? So, sodas are really bad. Mm. People don't normally think about Gatorades. Athletes drink, especially right. not so hot. Gatorade on their teeth, on a dry mm. mouth, lots of sugar. So you're going to get, we see a lot of athletes come around with cavities when it's real hot. Wow. So they need the Gatorade, but you got to follow it with water. Yeah. So sugary drinks are can be as bad as candy. Huh? Yeah, absolutely. Really? That's mm -hmm. interesting. Didn't that? Absolutely. What about like Shine or Bach? <laughs> beer, yeah. Is beer <laughs> recommended beer by dentists? It does have sugar in it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just something to touch on these these two extra rooms um, are designed now for surgery ops. Um, oh, so God. hopefully here in the future, we will be able to bring some more specialists into LaGrange. Oh, wow. Yeah, um, so folks won't have to go out of town. To correct. Get we only have one oral surgeon that comes to town once a week. Mm. And, um, Dr. So Mayor for Dr. Ortho, so we'll try to get yeah, some Yeah, Dr. Mayor for Ortho. Yeah. So hopefully we can bring some different uh, options. That That's awesome. And, that, and those are these rooms right here? Yes. Mm. And they'll be designated for those guys. Okay. It takes the big x-ray where mm. you can see the whole mouth all at once. Mm. Ah. How we look at bone and stuff at times. And now, who mm. did y'all pull that tooth out of? Yeah. <laughs> the hell of a cavity in there. <laughs> <laughs> this room here is something a lot of offices like to go to. It's a consult room. Mm. Mm. It's very pretty. People want to talk about their insurance and treatment oh, plans. Nice. Um, yeah. Sit down in private and you know hold a conversation. 
Yeah, instead of sitting in one of the operating chairs talking about that kind of thing. That's, that's something we can talk about. I mean, insurance, treatment plans, that kind of stuff. Y'all take insurance, I'm sure, we do. and uh, mm -hmm. just about everything. Or um, there are certain ones. Yeah. But we take quite a few. Yeah. So and like y'all have. To mm -hmm. And then y'all have different uh, different plans for for uh, people want to get on a plan with their dental care. Mm -hmm. Depends on what you need. We have it basically an in office kind of. Um, Loyalty program, mm, yeah. if you will, for people who don't have insurance, it's a really good way to kind of save some money and get your cleanings done, and so that helps a lot. Yeah, yeah, like a little discount plan, if you will, but it's an in-office one for people who don't have insurance. Right. Okay. Good. I believe it was that insurance company started a jingle years ago that they wanted two two cleanings a year. Um, if you ask anybody in the dental profession nowadays, they want at least three a year. Mm. Um, so that's kind of what our in-house plan is offering uh, to gear up on more preventative type work instead of uh, waiting so long on things. I guess they're, catch good. Them earlier. they're good too because it kind of keeps the patient on track of right instead of just coming in whenever they have a problem, yeah. right? Early detection again. Yeah. yeah, catch something when it's just starting. It's normally an mm -hmm. easier fix. Yeah. Well, congratulations on what is just such a great facility here. Such Thank a great you. mix of the historic nature of downtown with modern dentistry. This is really awesome. Oh, thank you very so, much. Yeah. Uh, yeah, lots of comments. And mostly everybody loves the, the work outside and what we've done. Um, just a couple of little things up with the signage, I think. Mm. That's right. And, uh, so hopefully it kind of shaped up downtown a little bit more. Awesome. Well, all right, Andy, you want to take us out? And it's going to be the final uh, uh, final speech with those chompers. Uh, <laughs> 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 we're going to do a lot of work. so. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, we're, you can find us at FayetteCountyRecord.com. We're going to link to the Brawley Dental Facebook page, and you can uh, find them on there. Go to their website. Check I'm sure hours of operation and c contact information is all on there. Uh, we're also on uh, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube. So uh, uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for reading the paper. And come on down to Brawley Dental and, and uh, get, get your teeth, teeth clean. clean. Yeah. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Thank you.